again. Good morning, happy Saturday. Um, we've had, I guess, kind of a busy morning, but like not in like a crazy hectic busy kind of way, just like a, I've done a lot of things, but it's been like slow and chill. I didn't sleep well last night. I never sleep well when Luis isn't here. Um, so I'm not surprised, but I woke up at like two and I couldn't fall asleep for like an hour. And then I woke up with the dogs at six, but we kind of laid there until 6.30, which was like prime. And then I took them to the park. They ran around, they played it so hard. I like made sure they like got a lot of energy out because I knew I was gonna run some errands today. But we came back, chilled a little bit with them, made my coffee, let them play a little bit more. Then I did a little workout and just showered. And now I'm about to run to Target, but I think I need to text Madeline and tell her that I'll drive. Cause I feel like she always drives, but we're gonna go to Target. Not sure if we're going to the Target like right by our house or if she wants to go to like Mosaic District because we talked about anthropology last night. We hung out last night. Um, so I need to check with her. But either way, offer that. But so Target for sure, maybe anthropology and who knows what else. But yeah, that's the agenda for today. And then I think she's going to come over. I don't know if right after or later tonight. I guess I should ask her when I see her. Um, maybe hopefully later because i need to clean some <laughs> but i did a lot of cleaning like cleaning cleaning yesterday but i really want to like deep clean and organize stuff today um last night i started packing up like winter stuff and i just threw them in trash bags in like our closet but as you can tell like this area is a nightmare i need to like put away clothes that i did yesterday and all that jazz but First we do our errands. It's nothing like fun I need to get from Target. It's all like laundry, gel sticks, shower liner, just like random house, apartment, little things that I need to grab. So I think I'm gonna fill up a water bottle now, text Madeline, tell her I'll drive and can pick her up and then start our day officially. Um, oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we need to start the day, grab a water cup. I feel so dehydrated today. I had like an Aperol spritz. Okay, well I had two last night, but I made like a regular one and then I made like a light one. Like it was 50% just sparkling water. And then I, like, I did a little bit of the other stuff just because, I don't know. And now I'm like, oh, I feel so dehydrated. So I'm gonna make some lemon water real quick. And then I text Madeline and tell her I'll pick her up. I just got back from my errands with Madeline. We got lunch at this place called Urbano that was so good. 10 out of 10. I got like crispy fish tacos and they were really good. They reminded me. What are you doing? They reminded me of the um, bar taco ones. But we did a lot of damage. I didn't get a few things on my list they didn't have at the Target. So I'm just going to go okay. tomorrow. Yeah. But I got you and your brother treats. Did you want to see? There's this like, he's like, uh, duh. There's this like dog store called Companion in Mosaic. So I got them some treats from there. Hold on, we got a show first. You guys already had one of these today. But these are those like no hide treats they really like i thought those would be good options and then this one's called goodness gracious i don't know it looks nice and the ingredients it's just 100 percent beef liver and um half the profit goes to animal charities you guys want to try a piece you can try a piece oh wait they're big Ooh, they're black too okay Let's wait until I'm done so I can monitor you guys eating these because I don't want you to steal from your brother. Look, we can have some of this. You can have some of this after I give my haul, okay? Because I also got you toys. You got more spoiled today than I did. We ran it, Bean. We ran into Anthropology. 
and I got myself a little candle that just smelled so good. I couldn't tempt, like resist myself. And I told myself I wanna stop buying things that like I could buy when I move since like that's happening. But like, this was just so good. It, the store was 25% off. I don't know if these candles were, to be honest, but whatever. I really like this brand. The, I think it's Volspa, Voluspa, I don't know. But it's Peruvian lime and it's Peruvian lime, shisho leaves and ripe grapefruit. And I love a grapefruit scent. And the jar is just so pretty and you can like, this is definitely one you could like freeze and keep and put stuff in. So I was like, okay, I'm buying this. It's gorgeous, huh? Means like freaking out. That's all, that's all I got from Anthropology. And then Target is where I was going to get most of the boring stuff. And I did get a few boring things. I got um, sponge. Not all of this is for you, Bean Anthony. Stop. Stop. Leave it. Little sponge things for the sink. And then I got like rougher ones, like heavy duty. But they're coconut score pads. It's like an abrasive scrubber thing. I thought these would be good for when we move, but they're non-toxic and they're like recyclable and all that stuff. So got these for some deep cleaning because we're going to try to get it clean. And then they had this. This is Bean's third Corgi Cola toy. He always rips them. He doesn't deserve new ones, but him playing with this toy brings me <laughs> so much joy that I, I know. Stop begging. I don't even care that he destroys it like this brings me happiness and then obviously you can't buy one of them a toy without buying the other one and i thought biscuit would like this one this one's for your brother oh wait this is so cute too so that's corgi cola and obviously beans a corgi this one's called toaster poodle and biscuit's a doodle so like that's kind of the same thing right but it has like crinkle in there which i think biscuit would like and like a really obnoxious squeaker so that's our haul for the day the dogs definitely got way more spoiled than I thought. Um, but I thought about going to get Target after I dropped Madeline off to get like toilet paper and see if they had the other laundry stuff I wanted. But it's like one o'clock on a Saturday and I feel like it's just gonna be so busy. So I'd rather just go like tomorrow morning before it's chaotic. And I wanted to hang out with the dogs and see them play with their new toys. But I think we're gonna hang out with Madeline later and we're gonna, can you stop? And we're gonna watch some more Housewives. Um, but that's it. I think until then, I'm going to put all this stuff away, give them a treat, let them play with their new toys. And then I think I'm going to try to start organizing some of the kitchen stuff. And I want to start packing up like wintry clothes. Like I just throw them in trash bags. That's what we've done the last time we moved and what I've done every single time I've like moved in and out of college dorms and stuff. And it's always like been the best because they can just like fit and compact in anything. Um, so I think I'm going to do like the heavy duty winter coats and like gloves and scarves and stuff like that. And just go ahead and get them out of the way because we don't need them. So, and then maybe, I don't know. I'll see how much motivation I have, but I could do a lot of organizing. I think going through like bathroom products would be smart and like getting rid of all the expired stuff. But we'll see how motivated I am. But I'm like feeling good. Sometimes when you eat out and it's like really good and like heavy especially when they have like chips and salsa which they did i feel like i always overeat and feel really gross but i feel so like full but like not stuffed and not gross in any way so i really like that place it was called urbano i don't know if it's a chain or not but i would definitely eat there again i want to go with louise um but yeah i'm gonna put all this stuff away and i might just break one of these treats in half because they already had like one of these today and that's maybe a little rich on their stomach can you chill Look at him. You want a treat? You want a treat? He's like. I've got the dishwasher going. Some Brooke on. The dogs are tired from their toys. Got my water. And I think I'm going to organize this thing because it gets super unorganized very quickly.
break from my organizing to read and I just looked up and it's like five something and I I'm so tired I feel like dehydrated and like you know like in a weird like I think it's because I didn't sleep well last night so I might text Madeline and just be like headache head hurts I'm not sure what's going on Bean to come back inside. Taking the dogs out now. Bean, he wants to stop and smell and try to eat and play with every freaking cicada that he can see. Bean, come on, leave it. So, taking Bean out is quite literally. Oh, one just fell from a tree. Taking Bean out is literally the worst thing. Bean, uh uh, leave it, come on. Like, oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna try to just go to bed early have a chill night i just drank some elderberry tea i'm also like this weekend like okay you're about to like get your second vaccine like let's prep be ready for it by being healthy and having immunity stuff if my dog would ever let me get inside be go to Target. Do you guys want any more toys? Do you want any new treats? You want to go to Target? You can't go to Target. I'm sorry. You love it though. Good morning. It's Sunday. I woke up this morning at like five. Ooh, AC, I'm freezing. I woke up at like five something with the dogs and I was so depressed because I thought it was Monday and I was like oh my god I, like it literally just feels like it was Friday like I cannot work today and then I was like oh wait it's Sunday bless um but I haven't really done anything I took the dogs to the park this morning it's so humid so we lasted like 20 minutes maybe um and they didn't even play that much together I made biscuit run laps but we've just been hanging out at home and played with the pop tart a little bit he can like never let biscuit have any like exciting new toy so i mean biscuit wasn't even super into the pop tart and i really thought he'd like that so i don't know what his deal is but beans obsessed with it so that's fine but i'm gonna go to target now and get just toilet paper butter and like gatorade or like an electrolytes kind of thing so that way after my vaccine and like before I can just really like make sure I'm staying hydrated um and I think that's all I'm gonna try to like make a soup or something for this week just so like I can get like I feel like my throat's gonna get scratchy because I felt like I had a lump in my throat last time um and just like I don't know that's a good way to like get in a bunch of like vegetables and things like that so I'm just gonna do like a quick peruse of like those kind of aisles but I really don't want to get a bunch of stuff so yeah that's the plan do a quick target trip and then i really need to do some work in our bedroom i washed the sheets and i still haven't put the duvet cover on over like the insert and i still have like clothes i need to hang up i like put away all the folded stuff but i need to like hang up clothes and like put stuff away i kind of got like junky so i need to fix that but i think hopefully Mel and i will hang out a little bit today but We'll see. I 
okay like okay i never text people before like 9 8 39 i feel like that's what i'm like hey hey because you never know what time people wake up and i don't want my text to be the reason why people wake up because when that happens to me i'm annoyed so i don't want to be that person i'm probably am that person though sometimes but yeah let's go to target i just got back from target the pollen outside today is so bad i didn't notice it when i took the dogs to the park but like the sidewalks and like the asphalt yellow are my car covered but, like oh my gosh i feel like i can't breathe and i just have this like lump in my throat from like allergies i might keep rubbing my eyes and i'm like stop rubbing your eyes but they're so itchy and i want to show you what i got from target because obviously i didn't just get the three things i needed um you're on top of the toilet paper right now that's what i'm using as a tripod um but i got that i got this protein packed muffin mix thing only because i'm worried like if my throat is scratchy i'm not really gonna want to eat a lot so i thought that would be like good to make and it would just be like i can have that and like Luis can eat it and he'll be fine and not bother me what are you eating what's there to eat vegetable broth just in case um i got wipes for the dogs because it's gonna rain this week and i think we're out I got so now that I know we're moving and like we kind of have a rough timeline I'm like okay I'm gonna slowly start like buying things that like we would need to replace when we move one being a shower curtain so like I already have it we can just pack it and then you're not like buying a bunch of new stuff all at once so it's not like wow I just paid for like a u-haul wow I just paid like a security deposit wow I just spent like $500 at Target trying to get like new stuff that I need so slowly stocking up on stuff like that. I got berry stuff for smoothies because I figured antioxidants would be the move. Um, what else? What else? I got two Annie's vegan mac and cheeses. I just like keeping these on hand because they're easy. Another like when we move thing, just a oven mitt and this thing because the two I've had are really old and they're gross and dingy and I'd rather just throw them away. Um, same with washcloths. I just bought a new pack so we have those when we move because we can save the old ones and use them as cleaning cloths but those are from the old apartment too and I think it's just time to revamp. I got liquid IV. I've never tried this before. They had a lot of weird flavors like lemon, ginger, and acai berry. I got passion fruit. I've never tried these before. But I figured this would probably be a little bit better than drinking like a Gatorade with all that weird like food dye and stuff in there. Um, so we'll see. I'll probably Monday make sure I like drink a lot of these. That way like I'm already really hydrated going into getting vaccinated on Tuesday. We were out of butter so I got the Earth Balance butter. I make sure I get the soy free kind because I'm really intolerant to soy. Like it just makes me feel so gross. I break out really bad when I eat a lot of soy stuff. Um, which is probably, probably why I will never go vegan. Um, and then the last thing I got these like just Target brand eraser pads just so um, when we do move out, we can do a really good clean. And I really like these for like the stainless steel. I think you can use these on stainless steel. Maybe I didn't get the stainless steel one. But like in the bathroom and stuff, I feel like these are really good. So that's all I got from Target. I think I'm going to finish my coffee and just lay down i have the worst headache and i'm not sure if it's actually it's not the worst headache i'm not gonna be dramatic but i've got like a little bit of a headache coming in um i think it's the dog stressing me out not having my coffee and my allergies so gonna give the dogs a treat or a toy or something let them play drink my coffee and we'll see how we're feeling i made myself some tomato soup for the week um just now and then we have this like uh, bread from giant i'm just gonna and then I'm gonna start my cleaning. I was gonna try to finally make the bed, but someone jumped up on the duvet insert. So I don't think that's gonna happen right now. I guess I'll be putting away all this clothing that needs to hang. Those are blankets I need to just roll up and put away. And then the closet is a nightmare. All these trash bags are winter like jackets and coats that can be put away. And then I just have random stuff that needs to go in. It's like little drawers. This is bad. I think I'm gonna like try to organize Luis's side too while he isn't here. I don't know. I don't know where to start, Bean, because you are where I was gonna start.
I've got Housewives on in the background, so excuse all the drama that you're probably gonna hear in the two seconds, but I've had the best afternoon, the dog's night, literally. I made the duvet cover after like an hour of trying to get Bean to move, <laughs> and we just literally laid in bed for like two hours. It was amazing. I don't even remember the last time I just laid in bed during the day and just watched TV and did nothing, and it was so amazing. I also packed up a lot of like winter clothes and like work clothes that I wouldn't be wearing. So those are all in like little trash bags. Felt really good, felt really productive. Just fed the dogs. Now I'm gonna give them little whipped creams on their lick mats because I want them to leave me alone. <laughs> and I'm gonna clean the kitchen. And then uh, it'll probably be like 6.30 or seven. I'll probably call it a night on being productive there take the dogs out and just chill. But yeah, such a good Sunday. Come on. It's whipped cream. Oh, Fisky, you're getting it on the floor.